Tonight's episode is sponsored by Wigs by Shelly and Koran. Please remember to follow us on Instagram so you don't miss out on our deals. Also, remember to like, comment, and share. Your tea time. Auntie Shelly. Never bag a thing for talk. Hey! I don't really want to add it come from my little royalties, you know. No, well, then again, you're not giving mine, so. Wait, wait, wait. wait. We just started. Good day, good day, good day, tea timers. We are here with Gaza Shiva, the diva. One and only, the only diva in Gaza. The only Honest. one. Let me know the only diva for Gaza. <laughs> Everybody have them title. You have the first lady. Who's the first lady? Well, I think Lisa says she's the first lady. Lisa is yeah. the first lady. Would I agree? Because she's like the first lady for Gaza or the first female. I don't even know about. She's, she's, the, first she's the first lady. Yeah. Who is Vanessa? One of the ladies. <laughs> One of the ladies. One of the, me just know me as the diva. Hmm. I can't tell you about nobody else but me. You just started by saying you're not getting your royalties. No, everybody ever asked me about the royalties. Some every day them come, oh, royalties, you're supposed to get royalties. No, I know what I'm talking about. And the funniest thing is, one of the time I got talking about it, because I don't know what it is, I don't understand it. Like, afterward, I got to study and find out what it is. And I said, you know, I'm not getting royalties, which I'm not getting none. So you, you, you weren't signed up to BMI? He didn't advise I said, no, you? No, um, I learned about BMI and the royalties stuff after, after. he went um, to, to jail. You know, we're not going to call it that. The, 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 it the solitary, I, uh, con- the, the, the place there, it, the vacation the house. Hotel. Yeah. You understand? So <laughs> while the he hotel. was managing you, he didn't educate you on this? No. No, I don't know. We never, may I tell so, you, uh, never so what Anna was doing around at the ramping shop, like the studio vibe? Like he never did I tell you that, what was happening there? When oh, around the ramping shop? Yeah. Do you know what is the ramping shop? Where you call the ramp? A ramp, me the ramp. <laughs> I rub in a ramp at a ramping shop, so I cannot tell you. No, but you know, I, me, you know me, me really, what I like about you, let me tell you what I like about you. You're very transparent and you're not trying to make anything look more. No, you said that you were not guided. No. Uh, do you feel, do you fear him saying this in any way? Why? I don't understand why people make it look like, no, why me, why me I go fear him? The thing is, if I don't know something, I just don't know. Why make a seminar? Because never know. they're going to say that he should have educated. Because if you are not claiming for your royalties, who mm-hmm. is? Well, I don't know that part there. Um, but the thing is, all right, I don't go say him should have come and pick up for him because I don't understand the business side, which probably he might more know. But the thing is, at that time, he did manage so much artists plus himself. So I don't really think he even get the time to say, sit down with everybody and really educate them about what it is or what it was or how it should be. You understand? Because I was saying a theme thing, I him do basically everything. Were you one of his women? No, me and him never did. But in sleep? Yeah, we, we, you know, a four time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not call that. Almost four time. <laughs> was it, was it good? Was it, is, uh, it, is it big? Is it, was it sizable? Yeah, you really ask me? Me t- well, remember, say me and one of them will get because you understand. Yeah, that's me? why I say if you ask me, come here, you know. <laughs> we know. So you remember me from Really Shelly? Remember Sweet to the then? Belly? <laughs> <laughs> what? What would the song say? Mm, sweet to the belly, squeeze up the like no. <laughs> so Hello. so so listen, a lot of people on the net said, Shelly, you're capping. Cartel don't sing no song after you. Guy knows well, mistakes. people are going to chat what they want to chat. But say. what do you know? Because you, you are the diva of the guy. But we did the demo. I said, what? I'm like, what? Well, 14 years now? L- or a little longer. No, 14. About what? 2010. 2010 was a the little, last time. I a little you. longer. <laughs> yes, 2010. Go no, ahead. No, I thought the last time I see you mm-hmm. was yeah, around 2010. So that's 14 years now. People are 14 years now. Actually, they are Jamaica like 14. 
we weren't list, we weren't list bad. Yeah. <laughs> but so what, what, yes. what did you see? You know, why you, you see me come around and what? Then oh, me you. That's how I met you. Yes, that's how I met you. So I did a check well, for me. Well, it seemed like him did check for you to me. Well, you know, me, me I gotta be honest with the people. It's not a man who me dig up in my business like that. Me an Aquarian. So when me in my own little world, me in my own little world. Me no business with what what go around me, beside me, or even on top of me. When me in my own world, me in my own world. But me used to see Shelly come round, and we don't know so she come for the elephant trunk. <laughs> <laughs> we know we know where the chefs go, but we just mind with business and drink water. You get me? I say go. But yes, I've seen you, and we all know what is what, and we are big people, and I pick this up me also. Tea time of eighteen and older. Mm -hmm. Okay. I mean, 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 we're hearing about like feuds within the Gaza. Are you still friends? Are you friends with Vanessa Bling? Um, no, you know, me and that girl are not friends for a couple of years. Well, no, I haven't even seen her for a couple of years. Well, no. So, is there anybody that you keep in touch? Yeah, man, me are Hindu. Big up yourself, Hindu. She right, true. <laughs> right, true. Right, true. Yes. Yeah, Hindu, a friend. What do you mean? I'm going to show them. Um, Clarendon and thing. Me and I keep track, man. Me and, me and Kim good, but we know me and, me and I are not as close as in Dubai. We, I we had one Gaza Kim here. Oh, well. And she did right. say she don't really keep in, she don't keep in touch, but she has been in touch with you. Yeah, me and I, me and I are good like nice that. Nice girl, yes. Um, oh, you were there when she was told to leave the Gaza? Did she say I was there? Mm, no. No. Well, if she said me never did, then me never did it. <laughs> but I mean, that's I what we are work with. So, that's what we are working with. Anything she so said, never, or what she said. You never saw anything then. You never. Know, I never see nothing. A blind another yaya. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you have pr eye problem. Yeah, cataract. You see the cataract? Yeah, me see. Cataract. Can I see the correct? Cataract there, so. Yes. So, unfortunate. Very unfortunate. They never really see nothing. I me say I never see nothing. I wasn't even there. You and Cartel still talking? Um, no, you know, not not presently. I think we can start travel so often, like for the past couple of years. Some of them mostly back and forth, back and forth. Like they in a Jamaica for a minute, then cut gone. Some of them really hear from him for a couple of years, but um, we're good like that. Cause people always I wonder, oh, me and him relationship stay. Like if we're good, if we have feud, whatever. Yeah. None of that. Me, me and that man good all when me and him no good. Trust me. So you're looking forward to his release? I want him come, of course. I think nobody wants him come like me. Right now, if him come my pocket, fat, fat, fat. <laughs> I don't know. Everybody else wants him come up. I know the reason why me want him to come. You want to share it? or? Eh? There, you want to share it? The reason? Let me just tell you if him reach my pocket fat. But how? It, it have songs for you? No, you know what show him I get? You know what song him do with me? Oh, so you're going to, oh. Yeah. That's... Apart from Spice, I think, I mean, him sang them like the biggest song. So, if him for come, when him get couple show, you know, we have to, you understand? Yeah, so, my pocket fat too. I have to say, though, Sheba, you have aged like fine wine. Thank you. You really look very like, I don't know, like a like a dolly. Like yes, you could have been the dolly or the gaz. No. 40 and fabulous people. <laughs> you are looking yes, really just turned good. 40. I'm, a, I'm a nice with it. I'm a good with it. Yes. By 45 more, I look like 25. You know, next year me at 35. You look you look fabulous. Thank you. Thank so you. are you doing music now on your own? Um I kinda stopped the music a couple years ago. Well, kinda on and off with it. Um reason being. A lot of people never know. So after the whole other thing, um, I fall in a depression for about three years. 
So you see, while people in the day are nag me and about me, oh, are they gonna deal with my career and all of this? Come here, tell the people I'm waiting for me, you know, because everybody else I do something, but they don't know where they're going with me. And I've been like that. My personal life has something I never put panic. My musical life are one and two times is pass out if people fast with me. Yes. But my personal life, them can't say them see that pandemic. So while me day in that whole thing for the three year suicidal and if you go through it, still if you be a mother, you know that go already, you have to try to think about this, think about that. People did they tell me, oh, you need to come back in the music, you need to do this, but me never, me never have the help. Nobody never reach out to me like that for help. Me not tell no lie. Nobody never reach out to me like that for help. Because as de, them did busy around back a popcorn, you know, so when him left a popcorn, they kind of at them time there, and them did busy around back a slim, because you know, slim was his main ch side chick at that time. Me and him never did like that. So nobody didn't really look out for me. Nobody didn't business with me, and then I'm, I'm not the most friendliest, laughable person because I'm not kicky, kicky, kicky with everybody. So them not go really, you know, them never that show about the hundred for me. Mm -hmm. Because I'm not going to be nobody, no, nobody run back and I'm not going to be a tail and I'm not going to make you feel like I can get too friendly with me. Mm -hmm. So nobody never really asked about me. So I'm dropping out of the push and I'm saying, you know what? Screw, screw how, did, this. how did you lift yourself out of depression though? Um, by doing what the doctor say I should do. Watch mostly funny things. I be a cartoon. That's why I know every cartoon right now. Back up front from start things to, to make finish. Laugh. Yes, so I mean, I've watched be a cartoon, be a um, like sitcoms. That's why I know Martin, the nanny, everything from back to front, season one to season 101. <laughs> you yes. understand? So I have to do that. So I have to keep off of the net. So I never did know at one point, I know what I want on the internet. I don't know what I go on with Adi, I don't know what I go on with nobody because I was in a zone where I can't pay attention to, to them anybody there. else. All right. And at that time, everything gone blank for me. Like, I made a struggle with my kids, them. You understand? My son can't tell you nothing. Did how how many kids? Because you know? I know of enhanced. Three. You have three? three? Yeah, three mm -hmm. kids. A lot of people never know. People think I want one, one pit me yep. have, and right. I just my son. I have three kids, people. So and you're busy. You have to yeah. provide. And... Yeah, but um, I had two at that time. Yeah, you hear me say, I swear upon my two bit of them. Mm -hmm. I had two at that time. Coming out of the depression now, the man ended up breed me and put me back in a depression. Oh, <laughs> because we just had come out and him give me a belly pant up and the struggle with me a struggle. Mm -hmm. You understand? So, and why that happened, me blame myself too. Because you see, if I still like some woman, we just think we talk to rich man. Because I don't know what I do with broke man at that time. What do I do with broke man? Depressed and broke and gone to some, take up broke man. I don't have ambition, you know? Sometimes, some, some, sometimes it's, it's good to. Pick up. Maybe that's what you need. Sometimes they're the ones that give you the time, the 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 affection, and you know. Then no, not 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 time or affection, nothing. Let me tell you what. Let <laughs> me tell you what I feel like going. You see, because of somebody with me that did from high school, and at that time, to me, they already have a name, Sheba. I mean, I trust nobody for there with them. Can you know what come there with you? For you, I will come there with you because they're who you're affiliated with. You Even now, spirit, yes. yeah, I still have the problem. They like, that's why I keep myself to myself. I'm a cabal going and growing. I'm a goodness because I'm afraid for there with and sleep with any, anybody. Because I mean, if you come for me because you genuinely want me, or you come with an agenda. Correct. So at that time, me just talked to him because as some of them know from high school, I'm used to talk to. So I'm sure say him being with me is not because of the old artist and because I have a name or whatever. I did sure of him. In pocket never too sure, but I'm sure of him. You understand? Mm -hmm. <laughs> so at that they go on this one. Never have nothing to do with no piece or whatever. It's just that. And after that, I get my, my third um, child, which is a son. Two sons, I have one daughter. Go back in a depression for a little time because you know the struggles continue again. Me plus him plus the new pick me and one bag of dung the rabbit hole again or something. So fast forward to like 28, you know, I start fully come out back and you know, I'm a jump and two rhythm and I start do some something and then you have some producer like Skybad and um a few others will reach out to me and say, No man, you know, say. I figure say something I go on with you. You need to come and get back yourself up and mm -hmm. I try, I try for a little time and then the people them come with them thing again. I'm just saying, you know, I'm just leave this alone. So all through that, all through everything, me I tell you the truth, my son was my best friend. And I him see the whole of that. Enhanced. Yes. And I think even that probably gave him the motivation for one to become an artist too. Because I say, you know what? Me see what it do to my mother. Me see all them beat her. Me see everything. So I'm just one come. That's why I think him go so hard. And me tell them already, say, whatever me I get, best believe my son I get it. Because I pray double, triple, couple times for him get it. So if them see me lose or anybody pray for me lose or any over them dash for me for me did lose, my son I go get that. Jesus. And I pray off everything. I'm sure. I'm not ask when price. I see your son rising through the rank, I said, listen to me. 
Sheba had to be behind this. And it was one of the reasons why I reached out. Because I'm really tired of the cartel. I don't need to call cartel name for the interview <laughs> again. The story that I was intrigued by was you as a mother was in the entertainment. You know, you, you, you made hits and everything, but you know, but you, your son come now and look like he is about to take dance hall to a different level. Yeah, he not, has the potential. I'm a proud I miss you, but I'm proud that, of, you know what I'm proud of you. Oh thank you. But I'm I'm proud of you. You know me not really have nothing much to do with him career. Seriously? When him even tell me same one the music me not even did there in Jamaica. When him tell me some this is the journey me I got taking them. But the thing is with me, me support anything my kids them want. Do you no know, matter which way in life them want turn? I don't matter who them want to choose, which whatever gen make support them in Let everything. Let me tell you, when your son goes into the history books and see your songs being one mm -hmm. of the biggest songs in cartels library, mm -hmm. it's it's very hard to write you out of history. Very hard. So you so no matter what, if it is directly, indirectly, mm -hmm. he would have absorbed your energy, energy and the way. energy that's around you. So never, never please wear the crown that you struggle, even for him to come out now and to even for a son to pursue his dreams, which end up being music. It's a, a testimony that you stood by your kid's side. I did. I want to hear that. Me a legacy. You Sat are. Sat nice. You Sat are. Sat Legacy you are. here. You have to give, have to give what is due. In a history. history. In, in a history book. Sat shoots. Yes. It's, it's facts. Me a things. And <laughs> though you know, it shows that the, the, the bloodline is there in music. And, and the thing is, you know, where people don't understand him getting from both sides because his father is, is a singer too. His father is a singer. Yes, he's a singer. He's just not as established as I was. So, well, this, we are going, as we I said, him, what is the word never, I just said? Yeah, he never Blood participated in the, the, some part of the mining, so when I give him the hype. So, his father is not cartel? No, you know, some people always are. <laughs> no, I swear, I don't know why people, where people get the hype from. You can't be mad, me have you. No, like a lot of people come. Shelly, a whole heap of people come in and me DM and I say, talk to me, man. Well, I, remember, yeah. I said, I have some kids who don't really get a hit song or not really get that buzz. So, you know, really. Yeah, but me don't know why they don't think my son of him. Some of you, so I feel like uh, it could be his bloodline. No, them you know, can't calculate. My son of 22, I know I did in um, 2009. So, so he's enhanced, is not? No, I don't feel him. He's not even have a fingernail. Boy, that's that, that, that impossible in a whole heap of unless for some way me and him sleep and I mean, remember about it from them time. Before. But mm -mm. his father is a singer and he got between both yeah. of you. Yeah. Um, big up and hands, you're doing your thing. And as I said, Sheep, I'm going to give you a lot of credit out of Thank this. Thank you, baby. The, it's, a, it's a good look. It's a good look and it's a good story that whatever you didn't see for yourself coming through and through all the depression, Mm -hmm. I can only hope that Enhance will bring the, the where you want it to go in music through your son, which is like the greatest oh, gift. Me, me, me not tell a lie, man. You know, when you can't feel something, I feel some son, I got to go up in the legacy book to me. Not ask me. I pray for it, I manifest it, and I know it's going to happen. Are you, are you happy that you and him and Ivani, Ivani is not your um, Jesus. daughter, no? Father. I knew you did never busy when me did call him, you know. He never busy when me call him. Me not see nobody glad like me. And for all of the people that used to beat me and talk about, oh, me a child, look people for my son and me, I just enough found know Doa Ivan is not even related to, not even the petting on the yard, much less. Whole heap of people when me a fight for my son, you know, because remember that time my son had a little him, it was like 17. Yes. And when me a fight for my son, people say, oh, now your son him for choose. But me tell you something, sometimes sometime as a mother, we can pick up and we know what best for them when they don't know what best for themselves. Mm -hmm. I don't have nothing against her. Because I can tell her, say, of a fact, she is a kind-hearted girl. I know that for a fact. But up here, something up is here, a, something, a couple of screws. Something, me know when time I did, but when nearly clean my mother belly, you know. Mm -hmm. My mother drink quicksilver with me, you know, so quicksilver up here, so I might, you know. So it's not partly good. We go sometime and you know, remember to come back. Mm -hmm. But fear one, 
gone for weeks, months, and days. Mine will take a little time, in you know, a couple of hours at least, and then it come back. But fear no return. And then my son have the nerve to say, she reminded me, mommy, no, me not so bad. <laughs> <laughs> me not so bad. <laughs> me not, well, me not think me so bad in my mental department. Mm -hmm. But she, she's a nice, kind-hearted girl if she just get the meds not, right. Just not for your son. No, I'm no, not for my son. I mean, I have a problem with her being with my son, but just the, the mental part may not work for me and him because he can't have a mental mother and a mental woman and just him has someone, someone with mental problem. It may not work. Is there anybody from the Gaza, the men, that you stay in touch or anybody ever reach out? How is, your, how is your relationship with no. Popcorn? No. Me and him never have a problem until um the whole thing when we did go up on the in the live one day and somebody asked me about the same royalty or something. And I was telling the person, I don't know what's that. Cause we really never know for true. Mm -hmm. The person I said, you know, get royalty, she but whatever, whatever. Cause I think we did up on the live, I said, listen, look, I'm asking for something, I'm broke. Cause one thing with me, I'm not gonna me have when I not have. I'm not still like other people, I'm not living a fake. So what did he say at the time? Um, something did come out, I think about a week after me say it, me see post pan, I think something for zip or whatever I say, I say me never get no royalties, I didn't pay me no royalties. That's not what I said, but you know, social media love flip things yes. sometimes. So that's not what I said, but I saw them put it out. And then, um, Miss Popcorn put out a something afterward. I think him did I put out something that throw some shades for me. Mm -hmm. And me did both for go off pan him, you know. And then me said, you know what? It even, even make no sense. So from this, so me and him not really link. Because I'm like, where you all take up this pan here? Ed? What does have to do with you? Me and Addy still cool off or whatever the fact is. You understand? So okay. why you are take up this pan here, sure Ed? sure Popcorn had his own, own issues with Addy. But me, no, me did know for him issue too. So that's why me I said to myself, say, why you are take up this pan here, Ed? And what, I throw what, shades for me. Him did a film, a film story. I forgot to come tell you himself. Then he's quite all right. Well, that's a film business. But that's when me and him did good, as I said before, that time. Mm -hmm. And when I said I throw some shades for me, that's when I said, you know what, I'm just not about to deal. Me and him not deal, me and him not contact nothing from what after that. What about Tommy Lee? Oh, me and Tommy good, man. Me, me, you know, so me and Tommy good too? Me and I me think Tommy like, and everybody good. Yeah, Tommy, <laughs> Tommy does. Love Sparta. Yeah, Tommy does have this welcoming spirit in a yes. business with nobody business, but for yes, you. And I love Tommy Lee. I have to big up Tommy. He actually tell me he's coming on my podcast. I must text him and yeah, remind him. Yeah, um, in the Gambia. Gambia. Now. We saw mm -hmm. the video. Big up yourself, my brother. Yeah, for big life. up, big up. Yeah, pop that. You see, him. Tommy, you can't get him mixing up people's business. Yes. Him no business wanna concern him. Yeah. That me like with him, and me and him link right through. Yeah. So that that is good. What about hmm? What, what is, is there from me? From me from really there. Right now. I have years long a year from right now. Um, but me and right Javi now. Javinci. Javinci. Me a year from Javinci in a years, but trust me, whenever me and Javinci see one another is just a whole Brotherly vibe. He's a like, nice, nice yeah, vibe. Big up yeah. Javinci. Me and him will hug up and me and him just turn nice. up and hug up and you know, it just yes. you just feel cause me and them people never have nothing. Yeah, me and nobody never really have nothing apart from one person and that that's Who, that, that was slim. Yeah, me and was fighting over cartel. Good. We did a fight over cartel. That's what I heard. No, no, we she she did a cause of fight me about uh. So listen, I'm fight over people. Is it, is it that enough? because she was intimidated by you or she come on the scene and thought that she was going to take over the throne? No, I just think it's just the regular female jealousy with where the DICK is concerned. I mean, I think I'm not musical or I know nothing to do with career wise or anything like that. Um, I don't think of attention because as I said, me and him never did. So I don't like him did that pay me. Any attention him really pay me was mostly musical. Because mm -hmm. as I said, me and him was just like a quick couple so of minutes. So she didn't love with him then? Yeah. So I think that was more personal. And I nothing to do with career. I say I pay nobody mm -hmm. in my mind. I want to deal with all of it equally when it comes on to music. music. Mm -hmm. So that was just a personal thing because I think she find out say me and him do they do, do look up, look up. knock little boots or whatever, yes. which I don't think she should have did have a problem with because me did it before she. It's just that she did clapping before me. Oh, she get clapped first. Yeah, one year after me did I me actually do do, do do with I didn't know one full year. Everybody else come come get knocked before me. Yeah, the last one we get knocked. The last one and a junk in cars because street vibes never come out. I'll know. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, get something street vibes <laughs> with you. No, I see you on something if street vibes never come out because mm -hmm. I'm not a drinker, I'm not a drink. And then 
we drink street vibes the night there. Mm. I, I'll never forget the night there. And that's when me get, I open up my head and then he introduced me to him, Blackberry Curve. So The Blackberry Curve? No, no. You know the Blackberry Curve? Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh, the Blackberry, the Blackberry curve. curve. Yes. That's when he introduced Not me to the, the, Black, the, the Blackberry Curve. Yes. The one we set like to the sea, to the oh, left or right? Left. <laughs> I remember, to the left. Yeah, we can't really remember. But that's what happened. That's when he introduced me to that. So that you know, this that. is how women should be. Can sit on a nice white coat, dress up, Don't hear it. lead. I look nice and talk about the, the good times yeah, with Adia. We can say, boy, you know, it was some good little time there. Yeah, and because, all right, to me, the you, past yes, is the past. It, it, I don't yes. know why people saw it all up and caught up in our feelings over the past. The past is the past. The past is That's the why past. we have it, because it can be it's a memory for the future. You understand it's a memory in the present. Today is going to be the past tomorrow. So next five years from now, we can still on and we can talk about today. Me not, I'm not caught up over the past. Me talk about the past openly. And people are like, oh, you know, if you say this, you know, if you say what I want to say, first of all, my mouth, go out and start talking about it. Mm -hmm. My mouth not have no filter. Everybody know that about me. I'm going to say what I want to say at the end of the day. I think that's one of the reasons I didn't never really put me on an interview. <laughs> because <laughs> because you're, you're too truthful. You're too truthful. You're too truthful. You don't know if it fix up and nah, eh, eh. Mm -hmm. So if you notice, most of everybody they go up on a major, go up on major interviews. Like after me come out of Gaza, me, me I go up on like um Will Winford and I because my son met up on Winford too. Me never go up on another major for interviews. Yourself. Him. Yeah, for myself, guys. So you're looking forward to Cartel's release? More want him, more want him come, more want him come. I'm not in a lie. I'm glad that that crosses woman they come out now, so we see a little which chance. Which crosses is that? I want crosses, me know. When them tell her to go about her business, what they had some DPP something. Oh, Paula Lou, um, that cross. Yes. Yes. Call her crosses, her crosses, no, pick it up. So, I she, she has stopped my I phone. can't call, oh, so you think, I can't call her. I know her as Paula Lou, I just know that. One party is fighting to keep her there, and I find it to be a little odd. Well, she must have secret for them. That's what I, I would say. I mean, I know but I think time, she's at know. the retirement age, and I think she should go at the the date that she's mm -hmm. set to go. I don't see what could be here, and um, I think it's time for her to go. Well, I'm mean, not really know nothing about her. Mm -hmm. More than I know, I like her, but then I still not like her now. Mm -hmm. Because she stopped all up my food back then, which is still a try to stop now, and that she not understand. Because by she fighting against this man for staying in a prison, for a crime where he may or may not do, because I know we can't see no evidence to say yes, it goes so. She no not know all up of people, she kind of, you understand, all up of people, she left her hungry. I may not blame she for my depression, because she took away my boss, where was my breadwinner. You understand what I say? Mm -hmm. So you put me in a depression, lady. But, but you know, she, like would, she would have. In her defense, I would think that she would be saying there is a man that's missing and alleged, could be mm -hmm. alleged murder. So she's doing her job. She's doing her job. But if a man that's missing, alleged murder, and you cannot find trace or case, why you just feel like you're going to be, make it be an open and shut case from one somebody? You're not going to investigate the right way. You have to dig up. You understand forensic. A lot of people are flying the right set of people, flying the right set of people. You can't just determine that this is the person. So you feel like it. the evidence was kind of, they were made, like they, they trump it up. Yeah, to just, just pin something past somebody and that's it. Because the first thing that irritates me about this is, I'm going to lock up the man bought some weed in a hotel charge. Remember, they said stem from first, you know. Then while he was in lock up, I'm going to find a way to pin him. Mm -hmm. So all it left from a weed charge, one never just come straight forward. Just say we are locked up for them. If you get what I'm saying, mm -hmm. it leave from a weed charge with smoking weed in a hotel, fine weed in a hotel, whatever, whatever. Yeah, to, to this. So, so mm -hmm. I mean, like, as I said, I did shut down for three years, so I can't tell you what really so happened. So you're upset with... with with Paula? Yeah, no, look, I just think that she just bias and a personal and reason and unfair. You, I'm not saying that the, the, it, it, if it be an injustice case, or you understand justice must not be served, but let it be served in the right way, in the proper way. Well, Because when you listen her, it just sounds like a personal vendetta. It don't sound more of you wanting to justice do. to be served. Your it just sounds like something personal. personal. Do you think that the JLP is trying to keep him in there? 
um, what reason would they have to try? I'm to not sure you? because you, uh, based off of what you have said, in, in just on uh, what general public, the DPP mm -hmm. is the one that is really holding him. Yeah, there. She push for keeping and there. if you are if you are following the news, it is the PNP that took her out. Right, okay. but the JLP is trying literally to get her back, back in. in. All right, me hear that part there, but the thing is, in got prison under I think PMP um PMP constituents, right? Mm -hmm. They were in power at the time, at the time, and she was still a representative then. then. Okay, so that's so what that I'm saying. Not... So to me, I don't think the JLP I try keep him in a no way because um, there could be been, other reasons why, why they are trying to keep yeah, her probably and it, not, not it, and it will just him. spill over upon the, right. the agenda so, then I possibly I alleged so. because if him did if him did get lock up under for them then you would have, would have said, said yeah well me see now so them have a pattern fair play uh, why but they never have nothing to do with that at that time. They, he, he wasn't even sentenced in JLP time either. So mm -hmm. I don't, me, not, me personally, me not know. Me personally don't think that. It is political. No. And I have nothing to do that. Them have them different business differently where me and you and we don't know nothing about. Correct. You know, people in them corruption have them corruption something to themselves. <laughs> I don't think that part they have so nothing to do with So you're sticking by Adi the daddy, same way. Yeah, man, I still my boss, you know, I'm a dope, so I'm a general, no matter what. No matter what, still my boss, still my do, still my general. All if me and me and him is like a Tom and Jerry thing. All if we work tomorrow, we're good tomorrow, same way. So that's, that's me and him. Me don't know about nobody else. That's the dynamic between me and him. Yeah. You understand? Mm -hmm. So me don't know what I'm going to do after today. Anybody? Probably you're going to watch it and say, that girl's shoe on her No, no, no. <laughs> I think he would look at it and say, that's my soldier. That's yeah, no, I mean, I tell us, I look on it and say that she bad that girl on her mouth. Cause I'm always say, cause even when I come on the internet the first time, I say, Yo, I'm telling this, me, I did do whatever I will do. I tell them the time, I tell them, they tell them how much time. I <laughs> <laughs> say, Yo, you know, freak it up. <laughs> so, you never, you never afraid of shorty them time, then, no? Afraid of shorty somebody never there with her man. I know me, did there with her man. Why make afraid of somebody that people are there with their man, you have afraid of me and her man never there. I'm missing it in a song, me and him never there. So, so me and him, uh, I mean, you never mm, that one. No man, him just write that base off a uh, something. But I'm just saying, me just I use it as pun. Like yes. <laughs> I said, me and him never did. Me and so him that never song was a lie at that time. That time, that time, that time. I don't if that time me and him even did do nothing. No, that was after Christmas. So yeah, so, like it Christmas go. definitely after me and him. Oh. But me and him never did. I think him write that off a uh, um some he always get some inspiration from somebody's story but mm. like christmas people like christmas <laughs> you know, touch it like christmas and, uh, so <laughs> personal <laughs> when me and him I touch it did come like christmas is it coming true? like christmas or true world, yeah, world war Jesus. i want to tell up i want to tell about world war three but i can't you can't tell you can't tell you know when can you want spirit spirit right spirit, man. So. me i never have a i don't have a bad i've never seen shot i must say what Two time I ever see that lady, and the two time I see her, I can tell her she keep herself to herself. Me would keep myself to myself to come and go no women are ill, no girl, I'm not ill, nobody women know if they must sleep with my man, yes or no. So when me step in a place, I got chat to girl, potentially can I sleep with my man. True. But the two time when I see her, mm -hmm. I mean, never one out of the two time I never start sleep with him yet. One of the other time, mm -hmm. me and him did whatever. And as I said, I never did him. Shout out the boss. Yeah, and right now, I share the boss for me. I don't care what nobody else wants to see. I don't want to see what nobody else needs. I mean, anybody else want to highlight me, I don't care. Me in my feelings. You know, she. honestly, I she me want him with. I think everybody wants him with she, but yes. they must know them personal things. As I tell you, I don't keep mm -hmm. up to stuff. I don't know where go on everybody's personal life, but to me, see she as a ride or die. She ride or die. Me think that she should have. You know what? She would have been the one right you. But as I said, I don't know because the years. What about the new one there? What's her name? I don't know. I'm yeah. not keep up. That's why I'm saying I not even know. You hear, you hear me talk about me not know about the new one. I don't know about she. I like him. I must say a post or whatever. One of the time, me personally, the one that if, if I throw something or if I hoax. Because I say I don't follow. I don't follow up with social media like that. I don't, I don't follow up stuff. Because I said, he's a depres de depression patient for watch. So sometimes, yes. I don't follow stuff where it yes. like trigger me back mm -hmm. in a certain stuff. So you mostly find, say, when I'm on YouTube, 
That's why I tell us that Chelly, I didn't even know about you and Tea Time. Yeah, mixed up channel. Yeah, I don't know about that. I don't know about half of the mm -hmm. stuff that's going on. I must stay off of that. When I look on YouTube, I must say, the things that I watch people don't even understand or they wouldn't believe. Mm -hmm. But I look on YouTube for hours, I watch <laughs> under the sea and find the abyss. <laughs> find the abyss and I explore the, the depths of the sea and the new creatures. That's why I look on YouTube for yes. hours, I watch. I'm going to try to find a way for look business more. Them something I'm watching. I don't really watch mix up stuff. I don't watch nothing. If my son name not call, yes, it don't catch my attention. If my name not call, it don't, don't catch, catch my me attention. I would like you to leave today by giving women advice on depression and how to deal with it. Ah, shoot. All right, what I really like for advice you know, and how to deal with it. But truth is, me myself still struggle with it sometimes, same way. It's not something I really fully like, me can't say I fully heal from it. But at least me know for balance it. You get what I'm saying? So, all me can tell you, know, um, ladies, the best advice me can give you is know, just call upon God. Like, every tick, every tack, every time you feel like there's no way out, every little dismay, you feel every little uncomfortableness, God right through. No stop ball pan God. 24 7 44 8. God. That's how me, one of the way me get myself out of it. Like everything is like God was like my best friend, apart from my son. God was my best friend. And the stuff I couldn't explain to my son, and God may explain to. When I not have nobody, when friends are there, but you know what friends know where you go to because some friends you can't really tell them. So you mm -hmm. go to listen to them because they use it as a weapon. Against you later. Correct. So me just keep myself in a mile little But shell. nothing is wrong with it. And this is one of the mm -hmm. powerful things tonight's episode will be about is that depression doesn't have a face or anything. It can nope. hit anybody nope. at any time. I never know that this would have been the message tonight that, you know, you are going through it. I can say I was crawling, I was going yeah. through and it. And if you add Hindu, Hindu can tell you about fear apartheid plus cancer. So she's not fight depression plus, plus cancer. cancer. So, so it is something that is very, 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 you know, it's it's in the atmosphere. It's, it, it, it hits women. Mm -hmm. It hits men. And um, see a doctor. If you, if you don't, from my experience, you hold on to your faith. That is one. Some of you really need to go and see a practitioner. Or something. Trust or, me. Yes. And Trust see, me. sometimes it can be a chemical imbalance. You know, there's different things that trigger um, mm. depression. My depression did trigger by brokenness. So it, and it can be about <laughs> circumstances. Think, yeah, brokenness. Yes, no it can said, be life circumstances. Have me kids for take, for take. Shelly, you know, I never tell about this, but there was one at the time when me actually think about it, like they're not the house, and I think about it. So you know, so the cylinder look good for us blow up in here. Just lock up the house with me and my kids coming out and left them for nobody, them problem to nobody, or nobody have to say, oh, she's so selfish. I'm going to say, you know, I'm going to lock up my kids them in here right now, and this house shall be blown to pieces. And then look on the cylinder. I'm like, you know, so they look good for life. All right, my three kids are here. Okay, everything good. Me and them are got every right now. If I get kicked out of heaven, I saw you got them can go on and left me. But me now left them for nobody. And then me thought about it, me thought about it, pull off the cylinder, have the gas and ready. And like, uh, that's why I said, faith and God. Like, God, I said, what you do? Like, you think this is the end for you? This is not the end. I mean, I tell this is way before even my son reached him, reached us. And I say, there's a, sometimes there's a higher purpose. And I can tell you, depression. Um, if you think about it, mm -hmm. depression is your brain going bad. Something is oh. going wrong, just like your heart. Okay. Oh. So when your brain, somebody always said to me, why people say depression is so deadly. And I said, imagine fighting yourself. So, right. So and that's it, what you feel like. It's your brain. No. Telling you. That it's you tough. are not worthy or you can't do, do this. It's yeah. telling your brain. No, that part is real. Cause it's, it's, yeah. You're fighting you. So you're fighting somebody that knows you, not a stranger. Yeah, so it's, it's a difficult fight. Yeah. But I am I very glad that. that you Thank pulled you. through. Thank you. And, and you're people. here and your kids are here. And you have a, a, a superstar, a to be superstar. He's on his way to greatness. Mm -hmm. Enhance, enhance, and on my chair. I would like to talk to you. And I just wanted to big you up. I wanted to salute thank you. you and thank you for accommodating this interview. People 
still want to know where is Sheba? You have a name. The name <laughs> can't change. Nowhere, no how. Your songs will continue to play throughout the world. Okay. Let me explain to people. As I say, apart from the whole depression thing where I keep myself in, I just hear a story from Barbara. And that are the next reason why I keep myself away. Because the amount of where she got through me getting at the, this industry. You see, when you don't know nothing about the industry, you get robbed left, right, and sent. You see, when your heart clean and you realize your heart good and you're giving, that's when you get robbed. You see, when you're grimy and your heart corrupt, you don't go through half of the things where you go through when you have a good caring heart, you know? You think a little rob me get pant up when me don't even have already? You think a little people book all show, take people money from them for dub, so they make me do dub? Call me, tell me, say, yo, my friend, she, you know, me, me kind of weird, they come like me and your friend now, she we say, oh, you know, say, me have one little friend want a little dub. And you call me, say, she, but do that little dub for the youth, you know? Catch you, you know, me and your friend. That time you collect the money, you know? And don't give it. And me, you know, get the money. Remember, me have kids to feed, too. And you, and you, you think a little time, them book show for me. And them make me go go do the show. And them collect the money. Give me a percentage out of the first, what you call it, deposits. Because at that time, as me tell them, I never educated about how it go. And them take the second half of the deposit. So it's like me work for them get paid. Wally for them something I go through. And all of that, what I tell you, Wally for that, they put me in a depression. And it just made me discouraged from music. I just did it, then my son talked to me. My son said, Mommy, you know, say, me think, say, you're talented enough for your need for just. You need to just come back in this thing. You can't say it too late, you know. The first time I ever tell my son, oh, I'm too old. Me can't bother me a fat, you know. I'm not time for go skin out in front of nobody. I'm not time for show my goodness now. Because your friend them big now, your little friend them will lose him. So, mommy, I don't care about none of that. You talented and I feel like you put yourself aside enough and too long now. You can't come back, you know. If you think me I got have a problem, mommy, I'm going to be your biggest fan. I was your biggest fan then and I'm going to be your biggest fan now. I told so, you. So now, yeah, now I'm kind I of sad. I told So people see. don't look out for me. I do back my video then and I start back music. And plus, I look like 25 same way. Yeah, so. no, good. They look better than <laughs> yeah. some of them where I do music. So, so my son personally. I me. love the story with you and your son supporting you. This is a yeah. beautiful story. That's Please tell our tea timers. Yes. Tell our tea timers. Um, to subscribe to Auntie Shelley and give you a little song, give you a little something. All right. Moana, subscribe, share, like, and follow Tea Time You Don't Know with Auntie Shelley. And while you're doing that, just slide over to Gaza Sheba or Sheba Music on YouTube. Subscribe to that too, because me I come out with the bang and the boom. And while I do that too, just make a finger curl, go over to Enhance Music and subscribe this too. Three in one, oh, no more than that. Three in one, three star one time. Three Come star. On, <laughs> Be as on a, as on a slide, so I want to just get content. Content, content. From, from Auntie Shelley, from Tea Time, straight to Sheba. From Sheba, straight to Enhance. I want to mix it, match it. Anyway, it suits, Uno. See him, so it go. Right Thank this you. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Tonight's episode is brought to you by Wigs by Shelley Koran. Mm -hmm. Go mm -hmm. over to IG. Also, look how she look good. Yes. It's brought to you by Wigs by Shelley. Have a good night. Peace. Your tea time. Auntie Shelley. Me have a bag of things for talk. Tonight's episode is sponsored by Wigs by Shelley and Koran. Please remember to follow us on Instagram so you don't miss out on our deals. Also, remember to like, comment, and share.